Once upon a time, in a small village nestled amidst lush mountains, there lived a wise Zen master named Koji. He was known far and wide for his tranquility and profound teachings. People from distant lands traveled to seek his guidance, hoping to find peace and wisdom in their troubled hearts. One day, a young and ambitious student named Hiro approached Master Koji, seeking the secret to enlightenment. Master, Hiro said, I wish to achieve greatness, but my mind is restless, and I am burdened by my past failures. How can I find peace and move forward? Master Koji smiled warmly at the young man. The art of letting go is the key to inner peace and enlightenment, he replied. To move forward, you must learn to release the attachments that bind you. Perplexed, Hiro asked, attachments? What do you mean, master? Koji motioned towards a serene pond nearby. Observe the water, he said. When it is still, the reflection is crystal clear. But when disturbed by ripples, the reflection becomes distorted. Our minds are like this water. When cluttered with attachments and worries, our vision becomes unclear, and we lose sight of our true selves. Hero nodded, intrigued by the analogy. But how do I let go, Master, he asked. Master Koji replied, begin by acknowledging and accepting your past failures, mistakes, and regrets. They are a part of your journey, but they do not define you. Embrace them as valuable lessons and stepping stones toward growth. Hiro listened intently, eager to learn more. Next, Koji continued, practice forgiveness, for others and, most importantly, yourself. Holding on to grudges and self-blame only perpetuates suffering. Letting go of resentment frees your heart, allowing compassion and understanding to flow. With a sense of realization, Hiro asked, but what about my aspirations, master? Should I not strive for greatness? Of course, you should, Koji replied, but do so with a detached spirit. When you are not overly attached to success or failure, you can act with a clear mind and a pure heart. Enjoy the journey without fixating on the destination. The young student took the wisdom to heart and began applying these teachings to his daily life. He learned to meditate, finding solace in stillness, and spent time in nature to reconnect with its simple beauty. Slowly, Hiro started to release his worries and fears, becoming lighter in spirit. One day, while meditating in the village garden, Hiro experienced a profound revelation. He realized that he was not his past, nor was he defined by his ambitions. He was an ever-changing being, constantly evolving, just like the flowing water. He rushed to Master Koji, bursting with excitement, and shared his insight. Master, Hiro exclaimed, I understand now. The art of letting go has set me free. I feel at peace, unburdened by the weight of my past and future. Master Koji beamed with joy, seeing the transformation in his student. You have discovered a profound truth, young one, he said. The journey to enlightenment is not about gaining or losing anything. It is about realizing your true nature, which is already perfect and complete. From that day forward, Hiro embraced the art of letting go as a way of life. He found peace in the present moment, cherishing each experience without clinging to it. He continued to aspire to greatness, but his heart was light, and his mind was clear. The wisdom of Master Koji and the art of letting go spread throughout the village and beyond. People came from all walks of life to learn from the enlightened student who had found the path to inner peace. And so, the story of, The Art of Letting Go, became a timeless reminder that, in the journey of life, the key to true fulfillment lies in the release of attachments and the acceptance of the present moment. For it is in letting go that we discover the boundless freedom and serenity that reside within us all.